The member of parliament for the Ayawaso West work on constituency, Lydia uh, Sayram uh, uh, Al-Hassan, uh, has also disclosed that she has compensated a victim who sustained serious injuries in that particular by-election that was mad with violence, if you recall, exactly a year ago. She was speaking during the one-year anniversary of the by-elections in Accra. A by-election that was supposed to elect a new member of parliament turned violent. Madam Lydia Sayram Al-Hassan stood to replace her husband as member of parliament for the area. She secured 12,041 votes, representing 68.8% of votes to win the elections. Marking the one-year anniversary of the event, Lydia Sayram Al-Hassan expressed worry at the violence that characterized the by-election. For a year of peaceful coexistence between her and her opponents, what happened? By the grace of God, our uh, President, His Excellency Nana Dudanko Akufuado, has done all that there is to be done about it. So I think we should let it pass and move on as a country. Ayawaso West has been a very peaceful constituency. We've had elections over elections over elections. It has never ever happened before in the history of this constituency. It will never happen again. She said she has constantly visited the victim who suffered severe injuries and presented monies in a form of compensation to him. I visit him regularly. I see him. And I think that is enough. Initially, initially there was this media hola baloo about the relative not ready to meet me and all that. So that took some time. But after a while, I started visiting and I visited, even last week or so, I was in Fadama to visit the gentleman. She called on her constituents to avoid politics of violence in the run-up to the 2020 elections. The Member of Parliament used the opportunity to distribute learning materials to pupils in the basic schools of her constituency.